Good morning. Good morning. Good Monday morning. I'm fired up. We're going to have us a little chit chat patty whack. I am fired up. I hope that you'll stick around and listen to what I have to say. It's going to be a little scattered. It's going to be a little, I, I'm like going to be the scat cat of the Weight Watching YouTube community today because I'm going to be bouncing around because when I get fired up, see, I have never done a video. Got your water? I do. And written anything down before I did my video. I think about what's on my mind and then I verbally vomit it all over you guys and that's what we're going to do today. I have a couple things on my mind. We're going to start off by something I already talked about in yesterday's video and that is that yesterday when I was getting dressed for Disneyland, I'm going to get comfortable here. I had to change my top three times because they weren't covering my belly because I've gotten laxed. I have let life get in the way and I have put on a little belly weight and it is all in my belly and I know exactly where it's from. Okay, but it unnerved me greatly. I was like, honey, you know, I told Steve, I'm like, oh my gosh. He's like, yeah. And I, you know, poor guy, I put him on the spot for having to be honest. I'm like, so do you think that this shirt doesn't look really good? He's like, mm, no, he, 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 that's like stepping in front of the firing squad and, you know, saying, well, if you feel like it, shoot me. If not, you know what I'm saying? You don't do that to the guy you love, but I did and he did. And okay, so we rode in the truck and we talked about it. And it's, he said, just get a grip. And I said, I gotta get a grip. So that's, that's that. Okay, and then I wanna talk about, cause this is all gonna come back around. Okay, so this morning I woke up with Steve at five and the first thing I do because, you know, I'd like to see my friends. It's like when I haven't seen them in a couple days, I, I, my friends, I turn on the YouTube and there they are. Well, first I went to Instagram and my pal Rachel Ann was there. And this, this video is for and about her and me and all the other folks that get on here and talk about our weight loss programs and what we're doing and sharing it with the likes of you swell folks because you're all doing it along with us right well i saw her video she forewarned me about her video it just about broke my heart if if she were anywhere near and i could have gotten to her i would have smothered her with hugs sat her down and then yelled at her <laughs> because she said some things like uh, fraud, uh, I am not who I say I am, I'm not doing a good job, all stuff that is total caca la toro. Okay, Rachel Ann, I don't know any of what I'm gonna say right now is to be true. I have to only speak for myself. So I'm gonna speak for myself and hope maybe it covers her and maybe like Steph at Holy Crap I'm Fat or anybody else who came upon the scene to share their weight loss program with YouTube audience. I did not wake up one day and turn on my camera and say, I am Anita Johnson and I am the best Weight Watcher in the world, even though I kind of am really good at it. And I'm going to tell you fine folks out there in YouTube land how you can be a great Weight Watcher too. Do what I do, say as I say, eat what I eat, and you drop those unwanted pounds, right? Okay, no, that's not what we're doing as YouTube folks, doing Weight Watchers or keto or whatever it is anybody's doing. We are sharing our program because it helps us. When we go to sit down and eat a meal and we tape it, we are being responsible for what we're eating. Now, at the same time, that helps you guys, from my understanding, I could be wrong, because then it sometimes it'll, it'll give you an idea, oh, I've never thought to eat oat, uh, overnight oats with protein powder, right? You know, maybe you should wake up a little more before you get on here and start yelling at us. I'm not yelling at you, I'm yelling at, I'm yelling at everybody, I'm yelling at Rachel, I'm yelling at me, I'm yelling at everybody, because everybody, sometimes, sometimes people get off the path and they forget what's going on. They forget why people do things. Now, I'm gonna address Rachel again. She is not on her channel to tell you guys how to lose weight. She's on her channel sharing her beautiful story with us and aren't we so lucky because I love her to death. She makes me laugh, she makes me smile, she's beautiful and she's having a tough time right now and I feel horrible for her and I wish there was something I can do and there might be and I'll see what I can do. But what I would ask of you guys is to remember that we're not here, I, Anita Johnson, I'm sorry, 
I can only speak for myself. You guys, I'm not here to, and no offense, please don't take offense to this. I hope I'm gonna go from 35, 50 subscribers back down to 35 subscribers. <laughs> I am here for me because sitting here and talking to you guys makes me feel so good. And having you guys talk back to me makes me feel so good. And sometimes doing things out loud helps you work through things, helps you see things that maybe you might not have recognized if you weren't talking about it. And if you don't have people in the house and you can't talk to them, well, you're gonna talk to the YouTube land, right? My initial reason for coming on YouTube and sharing my weight loss program with you guys was not to help you, it was to help me. <laughs> Sometimes you just have to be a little selfish in life and then sometimes it works out that it does help you guys too. You guys know me by now. You know I'm not a bad person. But I'm just trying to explain because I don't want her to feel that in order to, to be on her sweet YouTube channel and share things with us, things that I would never see in my life because I've never been in that part of the country, that, she, that we always have to be so successful. No, it doesn't. real life does not work like that. Now, we could start a sitcom, and we could write scripts, and we could get scripts, and then we could look at our scripts and turn on our camera and start bubbity deeky de blah, 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 and you should do this, and you should do that, and a good Weight Watcher. No, we don't work like that. It doesn't work. Real life doesn't work like that. There is no script to real life. We wake up every morning. We start with our coffee. I'm using my sassy Marie mug today, but you can't see her because she's sassy and we need a little sass. We turn on our cameras and we formulate a plan in our head what we think. We Sorry about the train. It's, all, it's always so loud in here. I didn't realize it until that one day somebody said, train, train. We do the best we can and, and we're doing the best we can for ourselves to try to stay on a really tough freaking program, a really tough freaking way of life, and that's losing weight. And everybody has an opinion, and everybody says, do this, do that, you know, and a lot of times, you know, some some people tune in onto my channel and they'll be like, oh, well, um, maybe you should, and I'm just paraphrasing, maybe you should call Jenny Craig. Maybe you should see if you could resurrect Jack LaLanne from the dead and have him work you out a little bit. Maybe you should call Tops. You know, I, I didn't ask. I'm not here asking for somebody to reroute my program for me. And no offense, please. Please do not take offense to that. Because it's just a straight statement of truth. Now, sometimes I do ask you guys, hey, can somebody rec uh, recommend a moisturizer or foundation or a, a laxative no I know my laxatives but guys I I want Rachel Ann and everybody to remember I, I guess I speak for myself we are here doing this for us because we're trying to get this weight off and keep this way off and share it with you guys and make friends while we're doing it and bounce ideas off each other and stuff but we're not a freak show and I won't and we're not I am not, and I hope that somebody will go, okay, Nita, we get it, and it's okay that you're saying this, because I'm afraid to say this. I'm doing this for me. I'm not doing it for you. What you're doing at home, off camera, you're not doing for me, right? That's the only difference. The only difference is I'm sharing it on the camera, on the YouTube, as the kids like to say, <laughs> because I have a big mouth, and I have to talk about everything everywhere, and I love doing it. But the end all be all result is I am doing this for me. And I want her to realize that we love seeing her and that she's doing this for her. And I'm, as her friend, I'm gonna ask her if she would like some, not, I hate unsolicited advice, but I'm bad that way. If, if I have black paint stuck on my face after refurnishing some furniture, and I can't get it off, and somebody comes up to me and says, hey, I know how to get that black paint off. I can see that you're not being so successful. Would you like my idea? I'll go, no. <laughs> 
It's just the way I am. I don't know why. If I want your advice or your opinion, I will ask for it. But if you give it to me without me asking first, it's not likely that I'm going to take it. I don't even know why I told you that just now. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. I'm going to ask her, hey, because one thing she and I have in common is we don't love the veggies. Okay? We just don't. I have recently come to figure some things out with them. Mine is more on the lazy part. I don't like cooking them. I don't like cooking them. I'm lazy in the kitchen. She doesn't like eating them. Whatever it is, I'm going to ask her first, hey, you want to make a plan? And maybe get our veggie game up. And if she says no, I will not take offense. And, you know, we'll work around it. We'll do our thing. I hope that this video is making sense to somebody. Because I watched another video this morning. It was not uh, a weight-related program. And I need to wrap this up so somebody will listen to me. Um, but it was a gal talking about uh, rumors about her and stuff. And somebody in the comment section, she's just a, a beloved beauty channel. I just love her. She's the sweetest thing. And somebody wrote, you know what? The, the internet is a, is, a, is a big, large world. And good for you for getting out in it and not being afraid. Because you know what? It's not easy. I have people watching me. I have people who found out I have a channel, who aren't even my friends anymore. They won't give me the time of day. I'll send them a text and send them a smile, hoping to spark our friendship back up again. They won't even reply to my text, but they'll sit and they'll watch my videos. <laughs> what the hell? Why am I getting off on this tangent? I don't know. It's Monday morning. Let's get this week done. I'm doing the five perfect days with Jessica, Journey to Healthy. Uh, Sheree at Motivated Muffins, Brianna at Diva and the Divine. Who am I forgetting? I keep, it's like, it's like uh, the seven dwarfs. I can never remember all the seven dwarfs. I cannot always remember uh, the four of us. It's Amanda Seipert. Amanda Seipert. You guys, remember why we're here and we hope we're helping you. And I hope I didn't offend anybody. I'm going to replay this and then I'm going to watch my numbers drop, drop, drop. But if anybody knows me, you know everything I say comes from love and from a happy heart and I'm, I'm happy. I love you guys so much and I love her so much and I love this whole community so much, but it's never gonna go by a script. I refuse anyways. There may be other people who use scripts. I will never use a script. I'm just gonna sit here and talk to you guys and hope that you never expect anything from me, but maybe a little levity in life. The only thing that I'm hoping to ever, ever, Levity and enthusiasm for losing your weight. I try to keep us enthused. And if I drop the ball there, then you have permission to let me know. <laughs> All right, I'm going to post this. Go over to her channel and give her some love. She may not ever talk to me again after today because she, she you know, she, she, <laughs> she told me she wasn't feeling good. Then I started shouting it from the rooftops only because I want to shower her with all the love that you guys have given me in the past. When I've talked about my grandchildren, my dad, when I've had a sad heart, you guys lift me up as high as possible. And I want to do that for her. You know, you got to pay it forward, but you got you to gotta keep giving it around. We got to keep giving the good around and the love. Let's do it. All right. Now, I haven't eaten anything yet today because I slept in, oh my, it's 10.30. I'm going to stop now because this video is already way too long. I hope you guys heard what I was saying. Drink your water, know where your bathrooms are. Love you.